You know that old house at the end of the road? The one that nobody ever dares go? They all have good reason to shy and steer clear of that spooky abode and its dark atmosphere. For waiting inside are all manner of frights, especially on those cold, dark, and stormy nights. It lays in ruin, run down, and overgrown. But to all of us ghosts, it's our haunted sweet home. Welcome, Welcome to our haunted house. house. Step right in, don't loiter about. The ghosts are dying to give you a tour down every dank and dark corridor. The shadows whisper and the floorboards creak. And every cobweb's hung with care. We've done our best to keep it cold and bleak, so you'll be primed for every scare. Welcome to our haunted house. Around each bend, something waits to pop out. A thousand horrors are lurking within to frighten you right out of your skin. A phantom's hiding neath that old bedspread. A severed hand creeps across the floor. Our basement's loaded with the living dead, and we've got specters by the score. A welcome to our haunted house. Ghosts can be real, but now you're having your doubts. Just spend the night here, we'll prove it to you By making all your nightmares come true It's bound to scare ya When you see our ghostly review We double dare ya Don't be daunted, brave our haunted house To spook and surprise and savor the screams and cries Then for the main event, I'll whip up some real torment With magic or feet so magnificent, oh How wicked by curse will be A spine-tingling symphony of disharmony And venomous villainy, my what a spell I'll brew, I'll throw in a snail or two And maybe a sprinkle of moldy mildew Every ingredient adds to my spicy voodoo Handful of mandrake root Teaspoon of eye of newt into my boiling, bubbling pot, what a hoot! Pots and jars fill the air to add some flair and help prepare this glorious mixture of misery, doom, and despair. Oh, what terrors will bring when my cauldron starts fizzling. It will soon ignite a smorgasbord of foul frights and sinister sights. Such wonderful, horrible, nightmare-inducing delights. Now, let's pick up the pace a bit. There's more that we have to fit. Some grime and some grit. And don't forget spider spit. I'll throw in this and that. The wing from a vampire bat. And top it all off with the tail of a rat. Wait! This is a bit too quick. I'll try to slow down the trick. It's out of control and making me kind of sick. Time to give this a rest. My helpers are all possessed and must be prevented from causing distress. Nothing will stop me from making my brew a success. I'll wait my wand to bring order and clean up this mess. Aren't you impressed?
houses wherein people have lived and died are haunted houses through the open doors. The harmless phantoms on their errands glide with feet that make no sound upon the floors. We meet them at the doorway, on the stair, along the passages they come and go. Impalpable impressions on the air, a sense of something moving to and fro. There are more guests at the table than the hosts invited. The illuminated hall is thronged with quiet, inoffensive ghosts, as silent as the pictures on the wall. The stranger at my fireside cannot see the forms I see, nor hear the sounds I hear. He but perceives what is, while unto me all that has been is visible and clear. We have no title deeds to house or lands, owners and occupants of earlier dates. From graves forgotten stretch their dusty hands and hold in pining still their old estates. The spirit world around this world of sense floats like an atmosphere and everywhere wafts through these earthly mists and vapors dense a vital breath of more ethereal air. Our little lives are kept in equipoise by opposite attractions and desires. The struggle of the instinct that enjoys and the more noble instinct that aspires. As the moon from some dark gate of cloud throws o'er the sea a floating bridge of light across whose trembling planks our fancies crowd into the realm of mystery and night. So from the world of spirits there descends a bridge of light connecting it with this or whose unsteady floor that sways and bends wander our thoughts above the dark abyss.
pum 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 ba. The smell of leaves is in the air and how the full moon shines. It's such a thrill to feel the chill run straight down through your spine. Our favorite night of all the year, we can't believe it's here. Oh, Halloween's the perfect scene to spread some fun and fear. It's the night when ghouls delight and ghosts come out to play. As dark as grows, our pumpkins glow, is there to light the way? Tonight the living and the dead can sing in harmony. So organize a grand disguise and join our jamboree. You can masquerade as anything you wish or dream. Like something really scary that would make your neighbor scream. Dress up like a pirate or an angel all in white. Or be a gruesome monster that will give them all a fright. Boo! Trick or treat, it's time to greet the strangers at your door. Let's fill their sacks with sweets and snacks, there's always room for more. A piece or two of candy should appease their appetites. So don't hold back or they'll attack and prank your house all night. Halloween's a night that's filled with wonder and surprise. And creatures in the shadows that are running in the Tonight we all can face the dark and crew, we're unafraid. Until the screaming corpse pops out all rotten uh, and decayed. Uh, so the uh, some bats and decorate with bones. To get more frights, we'll dim the lights and let out eerie moans. Our fearsome fun has just begun, but midnight's drawing near. Oh, why can't Halloween be more than one night of the year? Why can't Halloween be more than one night of the Ha 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 